the outfield. These are from folks grilling out. Sometimes I get a little confused. I might think it's fog, but it's because there's mass amounts of grilling happening over the next several days. The forecast couldn't be better for tailgaters out there. Throughout the week, we'll start to see some changes, but 81 degrees by 4 o'clock in the afternoon today will pretty much be the rule of thumb for the next couple of days. Our WVTM 13 live Doppler, if you're in from out of town, this is the only live radar on television. So if it's happening, we're going to be able to track it first. Rain will start to come up. The rain chances, in fact, from the southwest, and we perfectly positioned our radar to see firsthand live and in real time what's happening and what is coming too. So there's a couple of weather features that will not impact us until we get into sections of Thursday and Friday when we can moisten up the atmosphere coming in from the Big Easy and moving through Mississippi first. 50 degrees in the Magic City. A live shot with Regents Field in the backdrop. Calm wind too. I don't think you need the jacket with high temperatures today topping out at 83 degrees. Keeping those 80s in the forecast through midweek and then getting pretty close to 80 on Thursday. So it will not rain all day Thursday. We'll start this graphic Wednesday night. We move ahead in time by Thursday morning. You do start to see a bit more green on this map by 6 a.m., but not necessarily in the form of showers. I think we'll increase the humidity. It'll be cloudy. We'll get into the upper 70s and then rain looks a lot more widespread after 5 p.m. on Thursday. Some heavier intermittent spots on Friday morning too, but uh, consistently we've seen stronger storms potentially just along the Gulf Coast and offshore. There's an area of low pressure that will certainly drive a lot of moisture into central Alabama, but it's not necessarily going to create a severe weather setup for us. By 10 a.m. on Friday, those rain showers will exit. So this is not a severe weather situation that we're looking at right now. In fact, very stable weather out ahead of it. Rain chances Thursday, Friday, and then a great weekend ahead too for race weekend.